Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm really glad that you are joining me here today. I am going to be reviewing the April May Clean Beauty Box, which features one of my absolute favorite brands. So I'm so excited to talk to you guys about the products here today. I am posting this video on kind of an oddball day on a Monday. I typically don't post on Mondays. I'm trying to figure out what's going to work best for my schedule. Typically I post on Sundays. I'm kind of toying with the idea of posting on Fridays, but this one is going up on a Monday because because it is April 5th today when I'm posting this. And for the clean beauty box, we're not supposed to do the reveals until the fifth of the month. But anyway, let's go ahead and get into this box. Now I do not have the actual box that it will be shipped in to all of you because I actually already have these products. In fact, I have a backup of one of the products. I love them so much. So what I decided to do since I already have them, I am actually going to be giving my box to one of you. So so this is not only a review video, but also a giveaway video. So one of you out there will receive the April May Clean Beauty Box that actually features Live Botanical. So like I said, I don't have the official box that this came in because I already have these products and the box is not being sent to me because like I said, I'm giving it to one of you guys. Uh, but if I do have pictures in time that you know the Clean Beauty Box will be releasing like on their Instagram, I will go ahead and post some of those pictures here so you can see them. If I don't have pictures up, it means that they were not available at the time I published this. Uh, but anyway, the theme of this box is Immerse. Like I said, it features Live botanical. It is a $108 value. And then there are different pricings uh, for the clean beauty box. It comes every other month. And if you buy two boxes in advance, it'll be $44.95 per box. If you get six boxes in advance, it will be $41.95 per box. And then there is also the option to just buy one single box and that is $68. But just so you know, if you were to get the single box and not purchase multiple boxes in advance, it is still $30. 37% off of the retail price. So it's a really fantastic deal no matter which option you choose. So now let's go ahead and jump into the products. I'm first going to talk about the Tidal Moon Moisture Mask. This retails for $60, although I will say this is no longer available. Uh, Carolyn McRory, who is the creator, founder of Live Botanical, she actually created this for her um, Solstice Equinox Facial Ritual that she released over the holiday. Holidays. So that is no longer available. That kit's no longer available. And then these individual masks are also no longer available on her website. She might actually bring it back. So it may become part of the permanent collection, but that is not definitive. So if you are interested or you heard about the Tidal Moon mask and you have been curious about it and you were wishing that you had gotten it, this is a wonderful opportunity for you to get your hands on it. Uh, Carolyn's inspiration for this mask, for this ritual was the moon's tidal force and how it affects the rainfall of the earth. Um, it has a very sweet and warm scent and that is going to be coming from the cedar and the fir as well as the honey that is in this mask. I want to show you this beautiful, beautiful color of this mask. It is just such a gorgeous, soothing color. We'll talk about where the color comes from in just a moment, but I just wanted to show you the color really quickly. And then I'm going to show you the texture, which is really, really smooth. So lush, so creamy, feels amazing on the skin. And then I already mentioned this scent, but I just wanted to talk about it a little bit more now that I'm smelling it again on my skin. It does smell of cedar. I don't get a lot of fur. I get a little bit more of the cedar actually. And then it kind of has this fruity, like honey sweet smell that it's just really, really relaxing and it truly is a beautiful ritual. So now let's go ahead and dive into the ingredients. It has a bio-fermented May apple and I actually had to look up May apple. I was wondering if it was an actual, you know, type of apple fruit. And then I discovered it's not an apple like we think of apples, but it is a woodland um, wildflower, wild plant that does actually have a fruit that then becomes um, a flower. So the fruit does not look like an apple at all, but it does have this bio-fermented May apple 
apple, which is going to help protect your cells from damage. And this fermented May apple is apparently seven times more effective than resveratrol. You might be familiar with resveratrol being touted as a really wonderful antioxidant. It's actually in wine. Uh, but yeah, apparently the bio-fermented May apple is even more effective than the resveratrol. Uh, this also has Chisandra CO2 extract, which is going to help support the suppleness and resilience of your skin. There are two types of algae extracts. So one of them is the one that creates this beautiful blue color. It also provides vitamins and minerals. And then the other one is very protein rich and is going to help improve the skin barrier function. As I already mentioned, there is honey in here. It is local raw wildflower honey. So the ritual is absolutely beautiful. You just saw the texture that I showed you and you are going to apply this on semi damp skin. So you'll just want to spritz a toner on your face and then you massage the tidal moon moisture mask onto your skin, massage for a few minutes with your fingertips and then you can just let it stay on your skin for 20 minutes or longer. I have had this mask on my skin for probably upwards of 45 minutes to an hour. Doesn't cause any irritation, absolutely beautiful and just a really lovely relaxing experience. And then you can rinse it off with water. I do find that it pretty much entirely emulsifies off with water. Uh, and then I kind of like that feeling of the leftover oils on my skin. If you want more of that feeling that you're getting everything off, then you would probably want to remove it with a cloth, but I have not found that necessary at all. And then Carolyn also recommends if you want to focus on the hydration part of this ritual, is you can add a little bit of water, just like a few drops of water, and then kind of create more of a cream um, in your hands or in a bowl, and then of course spread it on your face. So then you'll get more of the hydration rather than if you just use the mask alone without any water, you'll get more of the conditioning effects from this mask. So as you can tell, I'm really excited that this mask is in this box. I'm so excited for you guys to try it. And of course, I'm also really excited to give away one of these masks to you all. I think it really has become one of my favorite moisturizing masks. Um, it's very calming and I feel like I can put it on my skin no matter what state my skin is in. As you guys know, I love to do the mask and bath thing. So this is one of my favorites to uh, put on my face before I get into the bathtub. It's just such a lovely calming ritual. And then I also really do like using this as a shower mask as well. So really glad this is in the box and I'm excited to talk to you about the next product which is probably one of my favorite products of all time. This is Carolyn's Lip Botanicals Ambient Moisture Liquid. This is a $48 value. I believe it is 50 mils. And this is a light moisturizer slash serum that is going to hydrate, smooth, help firm your skin, and also strengthen your skin's lipid barrier function. Um, it has a whole aqueous infusion that is created from local herbs, and I'll get into those herbs in just a moment. It's also loaded with uh, ceramides and hyaluronic acid. So it's just a beautiful blend of all kinds of skin loving ingredients and it smells beautiful. It smells like strawberry and I will get into that in just a moment, but let's go ahead and show you the texture of this product. So as you can see, the texture is like a lightweight lotion slash serum. And I really want to stress the serum aspect of it because it really is nice and hydrating for the skin. It just blends in really quickly. And I feel like if you have oily skin, that this could be something that you might be able to use on its own in the summertime, in the warm months. This is enough for me if I'm using a very emollient uh, SPF on top of it, then I don't need to use an additional moisturizer on top of it. So it really is multi-purpose in that way. I will use it over a toner. I think that's how Carolyn recommends it to put it on your skin over a toner or any uh, water-based serums that you might have. I actually, so I love doing that, but I also like to mix it with serums. So this is one of my favorite things to mix with other serums and just kind of create my own concoction. I will mix it with an oil to kind of create more of a moisturizing emulsion. And as I just mentioned, I really do love using this under SPF, especially if that SPF tends to be kind of on the thicker side and has oils in it. So it's kind of emollient. This, that's a great uh, combination of the two, the ambient moisture liquid, and then a really nice moisturizing SPF. So let's go ahead and talk about the ingredients really quick. I am going to talk about the herbs. As I mentioned, there are aqueous infusions in here, and that is from go-to 
Tucola, broadleaf plantain. Broadleaf plantain is one of those ingredients that herbalists love to use that just help protect the skin barrier, very nourishing. Um, and Carolyn is an herbalist. She is so knowledgeable about herbalism and she is more than willing to share her amazing knowledge and information on Instagram. Many of her posts really dive deep into the um, herbalism behind her, her products. Uh, there's also horse chestnut, which is going to increase circulation. There's red clover, self heal, which helps restore collagen and elasticity. There's also marshmallow, linden flower. There's also phytoceramides in here, which I mentioned. Um, Carolyn says that those phytoceramides work really well with the fatty acids and the sterols, which come from the soybean seed, which are going to help optimize your skin's own strengthening abilities. And then I mentioned the scent which is so luscious and lovely. It smells of fresh summertime strawberries. I am just in love with the smell. It doesn't linger for too long, but you definitely get a sense of the scent for a good, you know, 15, 20 minutes after you've applied it to your skin. So there are strawberry, cranberry, and raspberry seed oils in here, which are very lightweight and very high in linoleic acid. So again, that's just providing that beautiful, lightweight, moisturizing uh, property of this product. I can't rave highly enough about the ambient moisture liquid. If you have never tried it, or if you do have it and you know you love it and you would like to get a backup, this is just such a wonderful box to get, you know, with the beautiful Tidal Moon Moisture Mask and then the Ambient Moisture Liquid. Um, I just can't rave highly enough about both of these products and I'm just so thrilled that the Clean Beauty Box is featuring them in this box. And like I mentioned, one of you guys will be receiving this box um, in the giveaway. So if you do want to enter the giveaway, uh, you do need to subscribe here to my channel and then just leave me a comment below, um, any comment, hopefully a pleasant one. <laughs> um, but yeah, leave me a comment below that also has your Instagram account uh, or your email so that I can contact you if you are the winner. So I will of course include all that information down below. I am going to be talking about one more box from the clean beauty box and this is actually a limited edition box and the theme of the box is within like i mentioned this is a limited edition box and this is free and true's new line of ingestibles and i just love these containers they're not really boxes but the containers that these products come in i think are so beautiful each one is worth um 38 dollars, i believe yeah 38 dollars. they both have six ounces worth of product in it so that is a 76 dollars value but you can get it for 48 dollars. that is the price of the box and that is 37 percent off of the retail value so let's start talking about the first one that i tried and that is called make me whole i believe this is the one that they're recommending for the morning. Um, this is going to help support optimal cellular function. It is high in protein, which comes from the um, freshwater plankton in here. So this has corella and spirulina. So that is the plankton that is rich in protein. This also contains acai, which is high in antioxidants and fatty acids. There's cacao, which is high in flavonoids. Kamu Kamu, which is really high in vitamin C, flavonoids, and polyphenols. And then there's also carob in here. So let me just show you what the top looks like. So you'll see it has this little um, metal top to it so that when you pull off the top, the powder doesn't go flying. And then here is what the powder looks like. So what I've been doing with this Make Me Whole powder is I have used about eight ounces of almond milk and then one teaspoon of this powder. And I was really curious about what the taste would be. Of course, you want to really enjoy these kind of supplemental powders in your drinks, um, in your smoothies. I wanted to make sure that it didn't take away from my experience of the product. And I'm happy to say that the Make Me Whole actually doesn't have too strong of a flavor. I thought maybe it might be, you know, kind of like earthy, um, but it really didn't change the taste of the almond milk, which is kind of interesting. I mean, it definitely has a little bit of that cacao flavor to it, but it did not really change my experience of just drinking, you know, really warm um, almond milk, which I was actually pleasantly surprised about because I really don't like things to be too strong if I'm adding it to a smoothie or I'm creating some kind of a warm beverage. I don't really want the taste to be changed too much. And also one thing of note 
is that the powder is super, super fine. So it didn't make the uh, almond milk chalky, which I have found with other supplemental powders that I do have. Sometimes it really changes the texture of the drink or the smoothie or whatever. And I don't really like that. So I was very pleasantly surprised about the texture of this powder being so smooth and so finely milled. So that is a big rave for both of these powders actually. So let's talk about the next one. This is the Body Harmony and they recommend this one for the afternoon and evening. And let's just take another moment to appreciate how beautiful this packaging is. I just, I'm so in love with it. I love how both of them look on my windowsill. I just, I feel like they're just very aesthetically pleasing, but let's go ahead and talk about the ingredients. There's rooibos in here and also turmeric. Turmeric of course is known for its anti-inflammatory properties. There's also cinnamon, nutmeg, and black pepper. So just those five ingredients and the cinnamon, nutmeg, and black pepper especially are added for their warmth and also to optimize absorption. And I just have a very limited understanding of the black pepper turmeric synergy, but my understanding is that black pepper actually helps potentiate the anti-inflammatory properties of turmeric. If you know more about it, please let us know down below. And then of course, I want to show you the gorgeous color of this powder coming from the turmeric, just so beautiful. And I did take a picture of my warm morning beverage that I made with the Body Harmony powder. And so I'll post that here so that you can see how beautiful it is. And all I did was I just heated up about eight ounces of almond milk. I put in two teaspoons of the Body Harmony into the milk, and then I just used my foamer, which helps the powder integrate into the liquid, whatever you know, milk product you're using or milk alternative you're using. And then it also helps create just a lovely foam on top. Unlike the Make Me Whole, this does have a pretty distinct flavor. Of course, you're gonna get a sense of that turmeric in here. Uh, the spices are not overwhelming. The black pepper is not too spicy. It's just everything's blended really, really well, which just allows you to experience the, the ritual of the beverage, having this warm beverage, just kind of soothing your soul and you know calming your mind rather than having the flavors be really overpowering and kind of distracting. I, I'm just really impressed with these blends and not to belabor the point, but I really do appreciate how the powder just integrates really well into the liquid. So it's just, again, I keep saying it's not chalky at all, which has been my experience in the past. So really do appreciate that. So if you are interested in Free and True's new line of ingestibles, this is the perfect time to get it. Like I said, both of these look so lovely just on my windowsill. I really enjoy looking at them when I'm doing the dishes or you know getting ready in the morning. Um, so yeah, really do recommend both of these. So that pretty much does it on my review for these two boxes from the Clean Beauty Box. If you have any questions about any of the products or how the boxes work, please do not hesitate to ask. I can always ask Claire, who's the owner of the Clean Beauty Box. She's really great about getting back to me if you guys have any questions. So please don't hesitate to ask down below. And then of course, if you want to enter the giveaway, please do leave me a comment. And in addition, your Instagram account handle or your email so I can get a hold of you. And thank you all so much for watching. You know, I appreciate your support so much. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. And and then I think for my next video, I might focus on PR that I have received. I have gotten over these last few weeks, some amazing, amazing products that I really want to share with you guys. So I think I'm going to do that in my next video. So stay tuned for that and I will see you then. Bye.